Hello everyone, I'm Helena Bailey and in this short video I'd like to show my favourite right pinky strengthening exercise. So grab your violin and let's get started. Before we start, let's do a quick warm up. So making sure both shoulders are relaxed and low, we're going to hold the bow in a parallel position for five seconds, feeling how the pinky is supporting the weight of the bow. Then we're going to lift the first finger off the bow, then the second, then the third, leaving just the pinky and the thumb to support the bow. Hold that for five seconds, and then we're going to draw three small circles in the air. One, two, three. The middle three fingers act as a fulcrum from which to pivot the angle of the bow. And a strong pinky is essential for controlling the pivot. Always make sure the fingers are pronating or leaning leftward so that the fingers can flex towards the tip or towards the frog. If the pronation is lost, then the flex becomes impossible. So this right pinky exercise is actually a repurposed version of Kreutzer's etude number seven, from the 42 etudes for violin. And instead of playing it at the tip, as is written, we're going to do it at the frog. So make sure you get as close to the frog as possible. Anywhere below this metal winding point counts as playing it at the frog. The most effective way to practice this etude is in three speeds with a metronome, slow, medium, and fast. So the slow speed is a quarter equals 80, the medium speed is a quarter note equals 95, and finally the fast speed is a quarter note equals 110. So the aim is to play through this etude three times in the three different speeds, with a brief stop between each run through. But be sure if you feel any fatigue that you stop right away and relax and stretch. Thanks so much for watching and happy practicing!